I'm Mike Mouse 94 and this is a Transformers video review. Hey, what's going on, Musketeers? Mike Mouse 74 with the Transformers video review. From Transformers Generations, this is Combiner Wars Devastator. So laying the box down for a couple of seconds, it shows here on the top all six Voyager class figures. You have Constructicon Mixmaster, Constructicon Scrapper, Constructicon Bone Crusher, then over here you have Constructicon Scavenger, Constructicon Long Haul, and Constructicon Hook. So just taking a quick look at the back, on the bottom here it shows Mixmaster in his robot mode, his vehicle mode, then here it shows he's one part of the leg for Devastator, then here it shows Scrapper in his robot mode, his vehicle mode, then over here it shows he's the other part of the leg for Devastator. So I think that just about does it for the box, the next figure we're going to take a look at is Mixmaster. Without further ado, let's have a closer look and see what he's all about. Okay, so here we have Mixmaster in his vehicle mode. He does have a green and purple paint scheme. He does have some purple detail for the side window. Some purple detail for the windshield. Some purple detail for the other side window. And a little purple details towards the back. He has some silver details for the gas tank. Some more silver details for the, uh, for the bumper. Some black details for the grill and a little bit more silver paint details for the other side of the gas tank. And that is about it for details. Kind of wish you had more, but what are you going to do? So for comparison with Mixmaster in vehicle mode, here is the G1 Mixmaster. So to transform Mixmaster into robot mode, you're going to take the front of the vehicle and rotate that around, just like so, and then bring the arms out. And here you have Mixmaster in his robot mode. Wait, what? That's not the right one. Okay, so let's start this again. To transform Mixmaster into robot mode, you want to start with the arms first. So just take the arms, pull the arm out, and then lift it all the way up. Just it's a little bit of a tight joint, but just lift it up like that. Do the same thing on the other side. Pull the arm out a little bit, and then lift the arm up all the way, just like that. And then with the back section, you want to unclip this. And then bring this around like so and then you can separate the feet like that then from here you want to take the back half and flip this back unclip it and then flip it back like so and then you want to reach inside and grab the head of Mixmaster and pull that out and then you can clip that into place just like so And here we now have Mixmaster in robot mode. So let's have a closer look at some of his details. So taking a look at Mixmaster's details here, he stands just a little over seven inches tall. So for the articulations of Mixmaster, his head can look left and can also look right. His arms can go all the way around. He does have a little bit of movement in the elbow joints. His elbows can move up and down. His legs can also move in and out, as well as back and forth. And he does have a little bit of movement in the knees, in both of the knees, they can bend as well. So that, the, that about does it for the articulations for Mixmaster. So now for comparison with Mixmaster in robot mode, and here we have G1 Mixmaster. Okay, so now let's transform Mixmaster back to his vehicle mode. So the first thing you want to do is you want to unclip the head from the body just like that and then bring this all the way back like so. And then now you can fold the head in all the way like that. And then you can clip this back into place just like that. In with the legs you can now tab the legs together and the tabs are in the two places up here at the top and down here at the bottom 
So just tap the leg together, just like that, give that a good push. And then you can bring this up, fold this up and in, and then clip that into place, just like so. With the arms, you can now fold the arms back down. There's a tab on either side of the leg, one there, one right there. And on the inside of the arms, there's a hole right there, and a hole on the other side right there. You can push the arms down, just like that, and then you can tab this into place. Just give this a good push. Lock that into place, do the same thing on the other side. Bring the arm down, just like this. You can tab this into place, give that a good push. And with everything's all said and done, here you have Mixmaster back into his vehicle mode. Now to get to the other leg mode for Devastator, you want to just get the arms, get the arms out of the way for a minute. You want to loosen this up here, unclip this, just like that. And then you want to separate down the center just like this. And then you want to lift this up. And then you want to pull this section out just like that. And then you can put that back down. Do the same thing on the other side. Lift this up and then pull this out just like that. And then you can put this back down. And then you can clip this together just like so. And then clip this back into place just like that. And then you can bring the arms back in just clip them back into place, just like so. And then with the, uh, the back end, you want to flip this up like that, and then bring the heel down like so. And here you have a leg for Devastator. So now here we have a left leg and a right leg for Devastator. You can obviously tell how tall this guy is going to be. So this is Mike Mouse 74 with my big review you've just seen from Transformers Combined Awards Devastator. This is Constructicon Mixmaster. Don't forget to comment, rate, subscribe, support the mouse, support your Transformers community. Stay tuned for lots more reviews to come. Join me and all my friends in my Facebook group called Mike Mouse 74 The Mousetrap. You can also follow me on Twitter. I also have a Mike Mouse 74 community. All the links will be posted down in the description down below. I want to thank everybody for watching, and as always guys, take care everyone.